I do not want to be making this video right now, but I feel like I have to. I just hopped off playing Clash Royale for like the past three, four hours. I'm pissed as hell. Look, this is not a joke. I know I pranked you guys many times in the past, but I'm not even playing, bro. This is just about... This has just reached its limits. I can't do this no more. I need to talk to you guys about this. So where do I start? I haven't grinded Clash Royale in the past four, five, six months. Like, I did not bother. I did not like the game anymore. I was, I, I, each time I hopped on the game, I'd get pissed. Like, how to say? I'd hop on the game. I'd, I'd, I'd pretty much only play whenever I had to record a YouTube short or a YouTube video I'd, I'd like every now and then, like beating Clash Royale, and that'd be on a complete new account. Okay, I'm going to stop waffling about that, but basically what I'm trying to say is I did not play the game much because it would just piss me off. Each time I play a game, I just get hard counted, and, and then I'll get tilted, and I'll keep on losing, keep on losing, keep on losing. And Clash, I feel like Supercell do that on purpose, that you keep on losing on purpose, so you spend money eventually to like change your deck, up uh, upgrade a new deck. They, they just want you to, like, they make you lose on purpose by like just tilting. I, I don't know, I feel like maybe that just may be me, like maybe I'm just bad, who knows, I'm not that bad of a player, but... You know, I, I'm going to stop waffling about that. Long story short, I never grind the game. But you know what? For the season, I'm going to grind Ultimate Champion. Because why not? And uh, what happens? What happens on the update? They decide to make goddamn draft battle for ladder. The, this is the worst thing I've seen in my life, man. This is this is so luck-based, in my opinion. It's luck-based. Let alone, it's like eight minutes a game. Eight minutes for them to lose. Imagine playing eight minutes, grinding like five, six, seven, eight steps. Eight minutes every game. You spend like half an hour, 40, 50 minutes. And then you end up losing all of them again. And you spend eight minutes each game losing. Imagine. And you're playing cards you don't even use. You're playing cards you don't even use, bro. And not only that, like, thank God. God bless all my cards level 11. But I'm pretty sure most of you guys probably have underleveled cards, and I know it. Some of you don't even have one max deck. You can't even max one deck, let alone have all your cards level 11, bro. I'm not even joking. But you know what I believe? I believe this was on bloody purpose. I'm not even playing. You know what they want? You know how level 15 is coming next month? This is a theory, and I 100% believe this is true. 110% believe this is true. They, they made they made this draft mode. They don't even care about like the player base. They don't care about the community. They made this draft mode in purpose so people go spend money or spend all their coins upgrading their level 11 cards so they can play in this mode and then level 15 comes, bang. No one has money. No one has nothing to upgrade their cards. And what does that mean? That means you have to spend more money on the pass royale. Oh, and we have to talk about the pass royale. I need to cover about the pass royale. Holy crap, is the biggest scam I've seen in my life. Now, but back to what I was saying, what was I even saying? Yeah, you spend all your money, and, and now you have no nothing left with the level 15. So now you have to spend more money on the pass royale and everything, so you can upgrade your cards to level 15. Because this game is so pay to win! You know, I always joke about how the game is pay to win, but I'm not even playing, it actually is. Like, it, gen no, no, it's not even pay to win, it's just like, they only care about, like, players to pay. Look, I understand Supercell is a business, I, 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 bro, I understand about business, they're trying to make money, but bro, seriously, Stupid so be a little bit ethical here, bro. Be a little bit ethical. Don't just think about money. Try to think about some other stuff. But what what have been your updates recently? Super Archers Challenge? Seriously, could you not think anything better? Super Archers? They probably won't even care about my opinion. But I'm not talking for my personal opinion. I ask people on my Discord. I ask people on Instagram. I ask people who I know. There's people who I personally know who literally left the game. Friends, fans, bro. There's so many people who left the game and I asked them and they literally say the same reason. It's not just me talking about this, bro. Super so don't don't just think oh it's just me raging at Clash Royale and like think I'm not even playing. It's so much people agreeing with me. I, I haven't seen any good updates recently. Like you take no risk, no nothing. Anyways, but now let's go back. So no updates, no nothing. Now let's talk about the past royale. Bro, the part are you serious? You made the levels uh, like level, uh, I mean, twelve pounds. To I don't know how much that currency is in America, but still, that's like thirteen dollars. It's like, bro, it doesn't even matter where you live. That's a lot. And I realized, bro, the diamond pass is the biggest scam I've seen in my life. Bro, are you serious? Twelve pounds. What do you get? One miserable archer queen, which I already have. Bro, I have my archer queen maxed. But I'm not even talking about me. I'm talking about players in, in general. Either way, one single archer queen, really? And then a shitty banner. What is this bullshit, bro? Are you for real? I, I thought the diamond pass was going to be sick. I didn't even check. I thought it was going to be some next level pass. I thought, bro, the gold pass is an even bigger scam. But what are you going to get? Like some coins here and there? And what? Some some wild cards? Oh my days, Supercell. Oh my days. You know what I suggest? I know I'm going to, I know in like two, three hours time, my rage is going to go. And half the, half the things I just said may have been exaggerated. But I'm not even joking. I've actually been thinking this even when I'm like feeling normal. Like this game is actually like... Out of updates, out of ideas, out of content. It just feels like they care about money. It feels like it. In between the pass royale, the level 15, the level 11, it's all just one big massive scam. 
But now, I just want to talk about what they could do. What I think, after talking to many people, what would actually be good for the game. I mean, I'm not I'm not a developer. I don't know what this is about. I may be wrong. I, this may be a really bad idea. But I'm thinking, like, something different. Something that people would do. Maybe, like, a 4v4 game mode or 3v3 game mode. I think that might be good because i've asked lots of people and they said that sounds like a good idea now i'm not sure if that's possible or not but i don't know i'm just i'm just putting things out there but i know a 3v3 gamer would do good either way when i make a community post on it it gets so much engagement so many people engage with the post so many, it gets so many likes people like the idea i'm just thinking you could you could do so much stuff like i said not just add another super champion card but make the posture a little better add some shitty banners but do, do even care about the banners i don't at the store it was a little fun i can't lie but i don't even care about them anymore i don't know about you guys maybe you guys do i don't know i don't know i'm just saying personally i think i think it's a waste but i don't even care about the banners i have the same banner for the past like what three four five six months i don't i don't know man i don't know just just please focus on something better just focus focus on just, just anything anything just anything bro Unbelievable, I can't believe I'm making this video. I do not want to be dissing it because I love Clash Royale. I was like, it's the whole reason I'm even like alive right now in this channel and everything. Like, it, I love the game, like, it's brought so much joy to me. It's a game that I loved, but back in 2016, it was amazing. Even like a year ago, it was amazing when the champions came out. At the start, thought it was going to be a bad update, but it was, it actually turned out pretty well and it boosted Clash Royale a lot. But right now, in my opinion, it's just going downhill. It's just going downhill at the speed of light. I don't know what's going on here, Supercell. You still see me a pattern up, in my opinion. I, I know this is not just me talking about it. I've talked to other YouTubers that I know of. I'm not going to mention the names but like they all agree with me i have I have so many people and now the video this video sounds even worse since i just spent like three hours grinding and lost until all i'm saying bro just just make the game a little better like just make it enjoyable just make it like <sighs> my days can't even believe i'm doing this i right, love you guys make sure to subscribe peace